he hooked there, who cares? Look, look, look. It, it, said, it said, he loved her so much that he got sick. And his real brother said, if you love her that much, go lay in the bed and act sick. And get David, your daddy, and her daddy to send her to your room, to your house, to cook you some bread and make you well. Uh -huh. All right? So watch this. David did. So that's what he did. Went home, went to sleep, got in the bed. David said, what the world my son? He went to go to his house to see his son. And he said, Dad, I'm real sick. Abner did this. All right? Listen to me. Now, Abner said, Dad, I'm real sick. I need you to uh, get Tamar to, 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 to get me a couple of cakes. Come to my house and cook some stuff couple of cakes so I can get well. So Tamar came to the house. When Tamar came to the house, she he said, lay on the bed, come beside me, sit on the bed. When she got close enough, Abner grabbed her and raped his own sister. That's what he did. Don't want to hear that. And the preachers don't preach that. But I'm going to tell you what happened. Watch this. Watch this. He raped his own sister. And after he raped his own sister, my, my, my. he didn't want to have nothing to do with her. The Bible said he hated her. Mm -hmm. Ain't that just like the devil? Mm -hmm. Get what he want out of you, and mm -hmm. after he yep. got you, he mm -hmm. treats you like trash. Mm -hmm. Seems like if I'm going to give you my life, mm -hmm. you at least make sure I'm better than what I am. That's right. Oh, That's right. If I'm going to sell my soul to you, at least you can do is give me a better car to drive. Right. The least you can do is make sure I live a little better. That's right. That's right. Satan will take you and use you up uh -huh. and spit you back out on them streets My like you a little bad. That's right. That's, That's the truth. Yeah. Mm. Abner got, he hated her so bad, he told his servant, get out of this house and lock all the doors and windows on. Never let them come back in here. You in the world now. Bolt the doors. Hmm. The Bible says, Bolt the doors. <laughs> Watch this. Watch this. And then, imagine how she felt. Now, she was a virgin. Mm -hmm. She was pure. She was pure. Oh it got raped by her own oh brother. Outside of the door, the truth of the matter is, after he raped her, she didn't want to leave because she felt like I ain't no good to nobody now. You took all I had. I ain't no good to nobody. And he still kicked out and bolted the door. <laughs> Outside of the door, the door don't got nowhere to go. Hmm. Watch what she does. She had on long sleeves. And at that time when you wore long sleeves, that means you were a virgin. You were pure. She ripped the long sleeves off and began to put ashes on top of her head. Are you listening to me? Mm -hmm. She began to put ashes on the top of her head because she felt like I was nothing. Mm. I'm not beautiful no more. I'm nobody. I need you to hear this tablet. <clears throat> and then her brother, Absalom, her older brother that was married, they had the same mama and daddy. Said, what happened? She told him what happened. And he said, don't tell nobody. Yeah. Hold that. I need you to hear this text because I'm going to show you why this text tie in. He said, said, what I'm going to do for you is I'm going to give you beauty. Beautiful ashes. Beautiful. 
betrayed you. All the hell that you put up with. Where you thought you lost your beauty. Oh, I'm going to take the ashes back off of your head. Yeah. Yeah. And replace you with the That's right. That's what this text is saying. What is I got to tell Zion because Zion don't understand that all that you going through, yes, sir. I'm about to make a trade with you. Yeah. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Like I got joy uh -huh. yes, for your morning. Uh -huh. I got all the joy. For every time you cry, I'm going to give you a little bit of all the joy. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Hallelujah, somebody up and say hallelujah. Hallelujah. He says, because you're heavy, I'm going to give you a garment of praise. Uh huh. Great. Yes, sir. Watch this. Watch this text. I'm in the text. I want you mm -hmm. to stand in the text with me. Uh huh. To give them beautiful ashes, yes, the oil of joy for morning, mm -hmm. and the garment of praise for the spirit of heaven. The leader of God is trying to give you a praise. That's right. When you have it. Yeah. Come on. When you're going through, it takes God to throw a garment on your back. That's right. Come on. Yeah. Amen. Jesus. Ain't nobody talking about to be. I got to preach about Come on. Myself. Come on. Got here late because my legs are hurting. Mm -hmm. I'm aware of about being able to come here and preach this message come on. to you today. Come on. But as I got up here and I felt God Yes, move. sir. Yes, sir. God said, I can't let your toe stop you from giving me glory. That's right. That's right. right. So yes. what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw my praise <laughs> on your head. But you can't remember why you died. <laughs> but all you can remember is I got to give God praise. Yeah. yeah.
Come on, look at your neighbor and say, neighbor. Neighbor. 